future. Where did the promised mixtape go? Stay tuned till the end to uncover the full story behind Future's mixtape saga and gain exclusive insights you won't find anywhere else. Future's fans are scratching their heads, wondering where the anticipated mixtape, poised to rival Gunna's latest album, has vanished to. It failed to debut as expected. While Pluto did release a track with T Grizzly titled Swear to God on Friday, May 10th, featuring the customary back and forth verses over a trap beat. The full mixtape led by Future didn't materialize alongside the single. The announcement came on Wednesday, May 8th, when the March Madness maestro declared the impending release of a new mixtape on Friday, May 10th, taking a veiled jab at an unnamed adversary on X, formerly known as Twitter, stating, fuck yo album, shit ain't slapping like my mixtape. Gunna, whose album One of One was already slated for release on May 10th, seemingly interpreted it as a direct hit and responded with his own tweet. Turn this shit back up, Notch. Fuck what these boys talking about. This isn't the first time Future seemed to throw shade at Gunna. Perhaps due to his association with Young Thug, whom Gunna has been accused of implicating. Back in March, Future's X page shared a link to Gunna's music video for Prada Dim featuring Offset, only to delete it hours later. Future then teased a snippet of Type Shit, his collaboration with Travis Scott and Playboy Cardi from his and Metro Boomin's We Don't Trust You album, featuring lyrics that allude to avoiding association with informants. These actions were widely interpreted as digs at Gunna, who controversially accepted a plea deal in the ongoing YSL Rico case, for which Thug is still being tried. Other rappers like 21 Savage, Lil Baby, and Lil Durk have also indirectly or explicitly called out Gunna for his legal choices. In a recent interview with XXL, Gunna addressed the criticism, asserting that the tension isn't as palpable as fans perceive. He explained that none of the criticizing rappers are directly involved in the case and claimed to have had peaceful conversations with a few of them without disclosing specifics. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content from the Red Carpet Reup.